Hi everybody, it's Miss Judy. I have another project for you today using May May's um, cute little stamp set called Mr. Big Ears. This is her first stamp set that she has created and um, her uh, little company, May May Made It. The stamps are called M Pressions and this is Mr. Big Ears and he is just so cute. He's got lots of little Easter um, sentiments, um, different little fonts with it, funky fonts and funny fonts and um, an Easter basket, a bucket with a big eared rabbit out of it, um, eggs, uh, Mr. Big Ears, um, there's spring in his step. And I used that one on my card that I did on my other video. Um, spring in his step and um, that's a really cute stamp set but what I want to show you today is what I have done um, with the Artiste cartridge. Uh, I'm using um, a cut from page 73 and it, although it's a 3D object the cut is on accent one and I went to the Cricut Craft Room, opened this up, punched accent one, and then fit to page. And I got my um, little cutout that's this size. Uh, it's almost um, oh, six, six and a, um, no, it's about 11 inches. The whole total, but then when you fold it up, it turns out different. So that's the cut I used. Then I also used uh, Accent 3, Shift. I used the grass that is on here, and I just cut out some um, about one inch tall, and then I did several strips and cut it the way I wanted it to fit onto my little object. But, um, and then I used May May's Easter Eggs. She has four different designs. And what I did was take some of the designs and I put them on a piece of white paper and just randomly stamped and did some glittering, which I think adds a little bit of fun to it. And then I'm using, I uh, did four different sections and I'm using those on my um, craft. The really cool thing about the Artiste cartridge from Close to My Heart is it has a booklet with the instructions for your assembly part of the 3D objects and this one is on page 54 and it shows how to do the rabbit box and then there's a tulip box that's on that same um, cut uh, that is really cute and it shows you how to assemble both of those. Assembly is very, very simple, very easy. You just have to be a little careful when you put your little rabbits through the top. But here's my box and my little rabbits and I put some jute on just one of the rabbits because I want the children to be able to open it up. Then I took my little Easter eggs that I had decorated and I put them in the grass, just randomly switched, put them in there. And um, I didn't even glue the, the uh, eggs down, I glued the grass, but I left the eggs um, loose and they fit in there really nicely and I thought, well, the kids could take that out and then they could have some fun little eggs to uh, do something with if they wanted to. And so, there's my project. Simple, simple, simple to do, but it turns out so clever and so cute. And um, I just used the um, white cardstock as my base for this one, like I said, fit to page. So, I appreciate you watching my video today using the May May stamps. I also want to just tell you quickly for all the customers with Close to My Heart this month, 
that ordered from me my drawing for March and April is this uh, home decor workshop on the go canvas art kit. I don't have mine yet. When I do, I'll decorate it and then I'll show you live what it looks like. Uh, but it really is a neat um, concept and I can't wait to do this one when I get it. So you can order from my site. You can also order the stamps from MayMayMadeIt.com. Mr. Big Ears, thank you all so much for watching my video. I love talking to all of you, and I love talking to myself. Ta-ta!